the ethical guidelines of IPFW information technology users. The IPFW Code of Student Rights, Responsibilities, and Conduct sets forth general policies and procedures governing the use of university facilities by students. Various university policies establish similar requirements for faculty and staff. The purpose of these guidelines is to interpret these policies and procedures for all persons using the IT facilities, including students, faculty, staff, guests, and other affiliates of the university. I will discuss these three points. The first one is the intellectual property rights and responsibility. Central to understanding of the rights and responsibilities of IT users is the notion of intellectual property. In brief, this concept holds that materials stored in electronic form are the property of one or more rightful owners. Like any other property, electronically stored information, whether data or programs, and can be stolen, altered, or destroyed, misappropriated, or plagiarized. Such inappropriate activities violate the code and university policy are subject to disciplinary action. The second one is the access rights and responsibilities. The use of lab, office, email, web, and other IT resources, including wired and wireless networks, should be focused on facilitating university-related purposes. Other uses, for example, using IT resources to conduct a commercial enterprise or private businesses constitute the thief form university subject to disciplinary action. Similarly, the introduction of information which interferes with the access or information of others. For example, the introduction of programs of a type commonly called viruses, of a non-academic network game simulations, is subject to disciplinary action. Email should not be used for junk mailings. And the last one is the general rights and responsibilities. Despite access controls, system failures may occasionally make it possible for system users inappropriately to read Use, copy, alter, or delete information stored electronically on a university computer system. System users are responsible for non-exploiting such system failures and for reporting them to proper university personnel so that corrective steps can be taken. All inappropriate users of IT resources should be reported to proper authorities for possible disciplinary action. Thank you.